head over to search and then type in task scheduler, click on it. And then we're gonna double click on task scheduler library. Then we're gonna double click on Microsoft and then double click on Windows. And then we're gonna look for Windows Defender. Here it is, click on that. I'm gonna maximize this now. And then I'm gonna drag this to the right. And then I'm gonna double click on Windows Defender scheduled scan. Once we're on it, we're gonna untick run with highest privileges and then we're gonna click on conditions and then we're gonna untick start the task only if the computer's on AC power and then click on okay. For the second step, we're gonna head over to search and type in Windows security, click on it. Once we're on it, we're gonna click on virus and threat protection. Then we're gonna click on manage settings. Then we're gonna scroll down and then click on exclusions and then click on add or remove exclusions. And then click on yes. Then we're gonna click on add an exclusion and then click on file. Then you wanna click on this PC and then head over to your C drive. And we're gonna scroll down and click on program files. Then we're gonna scroll down and then click on Windows Defender. Then we're gonna scroll down even more and you wanna look for MSMPENG. And then you wanna hover over it and it should say file description, anti-malware service, executable. And then you wanna double click on it. Then we're gonna click on add an exclusion again. Click on file. And we're gonna scroll down and we're gonna select the exact same file. And then you wanna type in .exe at the end and then you wanna copy this. So just copy it, click on Control C and then we're gonna click on cancel. Then we're gonna click on add an exclusion, click on file type and then you wanna paste that in and click on add. Once you do all of this, restart your computer. But if you're still getting high disk usage, then we're gonna head back into Windows security, click on virus and threat protection. And then we're gonna click on manage settings. And then you wanna turn off full time protection whenever you're playing a game or you're just doing something important, which is not really recommended, but you could do it at your own risk. 